So you're in Genesis chapter 1. It says, God said, let there be a firmament in the midst of the waters and let it divide the waters from the water. So this is creation. What happened is that there was water and God put a firmament between it. You see that dome? I'm going to explain to you what that is through scripture. That is the firmament. And everything is within the firmament, not out in the universe. Let me prove that to you. And it said in verse 7, God made the firmament and divide the waters which were under the firmament from the waters which were above the firmament. So you see that there's waters which we have under the firmament, sea, land, that's under the firmament. Then there's waters also above, keep that in mind, above this firmament. What does firmament mean? Well, firm, firmament, the, the first word firma actually just means solid and meant is just the end of a noun. So it just means solid thing. If you look in Ezekiel chapter 10 in verse 1, it says, Then I looked and behold, in the firmament that was above the head of the cherubims, there appeared over them, as it were, a sapphire stone as the appearance of the likeness of a throne. So above the cherubims is God's throne. And there's a firmament above them. And it says, as it were, a sapphire stone, the appearance and the likeness of a throne. I believe that to be describing the throne itself, not the firmament. There's a firmament above the head of the cherubims where God's throne is. Where God's throne is, it's describing a firmament under him. You see that? The firmament is under it. So I'm going to show you what a firmament actually is. Job 37, verse 18. It says, Hast thou with him spread out the sky, which is strong and as molten looking glass. So the firmament is glass. It's as molten looking glass. The firmament was under the throne, that sea of glass, and it is also what divides the waters from the waters. Is Revelation chapter 4, look in verse 6. And before the throne there was a sea of glass like unto crystal. And in the midst of the throne, round about the throne, were four beasts full of eyes before and behind. So, what is the firmament? It's a sea of glass. It is described by the Bible. The word itself actually does mean solid thing, but according to God's word, it's a sea of glass. And that actually makes sense. When you look at Genesis chapter 1, you need something that is hard to divide water from water. So I'm telling you that the firmament is what divides the waters from the waters and it is essentially like a circular disk, is what the earth is, with a dome on top of it. And this dome is glass. Not, maybe not what we think of as glass, but you know, God created a solid thing.